clearly Andrew's gone somewhere else. Hey friends. <laughs> Namaste dosto. We have bought our tar jeep on a road trip. We are. We're on our way to Jodhpur first and then our business partner friend Manu, we're going to Falodi, yeah. to his family's village for Diwali. So we're doing a Diwali road trip which so far has been super smooth. And apart from one bump. Apart from one bump, which threw the whole track sideways. Including and, yeah, all the baggage. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, but we've come to stop for lunch at a place that I've been wanting to come to because I saw it show up on a, someone else's Instagram feed. And it's a place called Pit Stop. And it looks very quirky. Now, it has a certain amount of nostalgia for you and me as well, doesn't it, darling? It does. Now, why is that? What are we looking at? It's a Triumph Herald. <laughs> <laughs> and both of us have had Triumph Heralds in our lives. Yeah. So that is now a swing, which is probably going to perform better than the old Triumph Heralds we did. <laughs> yeah. Those of you who know Triumph Heralds, they have a, a particular sound they make when you let the throttle go and go downhill. It's a ding, 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 ding. <laughs> so yeah, this is um, a cool place on the motorway between Udaipur and Jaipur, but we'll be turning off uh, to head to Jodhpur, which is our first stop tonight. And that is one of our favourite places. It is, Deoga. Deoga. Love it there. Namaste. 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 Wow, this is cool. This, this is, is fun, great. isn't it? Namaste. This is fun. Got the Vespers in the corner, they've got the ambassador seat over here. All the tables are done with the fronts of old Jeeps. Oh, someone's come up with a cool idea and made it cool. work. Yeah, they have. They really made it work. It's really nice. And of course, a couple of classic Enfields sitting right in the middle here. Even the counter has a VW front. Yes. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I don't know if I'd want to be doing huge Ks on this particular model, but yeah. they're still very cool bikes. Namaste, hi. Do you guys have a YouTube channel? Uh, yeah. Yes, we do. <laughs> it's reasons we love India. The reasons we love India because we walk into this cafe and we're admiring it, and a family are here, and then they offer us chai, and we're going to have some lunch, but lovely young man lives and works in Canada, Canada. has just recently been married and wow. yeah it's just it's beautiful it's the warmth of the hospitality always isn't it always, always. every time it's so nice this is a very cool place though uh, they've done well you yeah. know they've done well yeah it's very and i do well notice done. the light fittings are actually the very same ones that we had in our Ooh, retreat yeah. in new zealand i like that scooter darling it is one of the things i will have in our property in the future is a classic Vespa scooter. Mm. There's our new friends over there paying for the chai that they bought for us. Back on the road again. It was a really nice stop. It was fun mm. and uh, although we did discover that Google Bubba, bless it, <laughs> has taken us about an hour further out of our route than we needed to. But we telling ended us up this, in a nice place. But we ended up in a nice place. <laughs> so right? I don't think we're going to complain. <laughs> no. There's no time sort of uh, limit or pressure Pressure to do. No. And, and as I said, I'd wanted to come here, so yeah. hopefully... Um, so it's your fault. Okay, I'll own it. <laughs> I'll own it. At some level I manifested yeah, it. Is yeah, that you what did. you say? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to the beloved tar. It's a lovely, lovely market. So colourful, beautiful fresh fruit and vegetables. Special things for Diwali, Kapuja. A really nice atmosphere here. Be quite wonderful. Hi, Mr. Mermaid. <laughs> Doing some off-roading, Jonna. Just a little, a little off-roading. <laughs> this is a really lovely place. <laughs> well, you think you need a four-wheel drive for this kind of territory and then you just watch the little auto in front of you making its way through these <laughs> foot-high potholes. They are literally foot-high. It's oh. crazy. 
so we've uh, got back onto where Google is telling us to go. <coughs> Are you um, preparing the divorce papers, darling? Uh, no, not quite. I'm, I'm just glad that my my arm is connected <laughs> to itself. And um... because when the bridge is a riverbed, you yeah. know you have come to. Um, well, uh, I don't know how to describe this road. It's a beautiful scenery. Okay. Can we just focus on that? Yeah. And it's and it's moments like this that I just love owning the tarp. Oh, my wife, what I put you through, darling. Oh. And here I thought in my head, oh, smooth highway, you'll be fine. That's what we thought, didn't we? Uh -huh. yep. oh. oh, God. Okay, I think, oh. I think we're through the worst I of it. I can breathe out now. <laughs> Honestly, that, that was some pretty intense driving when, um, yeah. Your this is a one. nice new road. This is a nice road. This is a oh. road. But, yeah. When your wife is going, holy hell, and testament to the healing though, testament to the healing. Oh uh, yeah, the muscles still hurt. Oh my god, um, look at this road, honey, it's so smooth. We're not going back this way. Well, you can and I'll fly. <laughs> <laughs> look at that smooth road. Oh my goodness. My wife is, Jasmine's blissing out right now. <laughs> this is <coughs> gorgeous, I'm yeah. loving it. I've got to say, it's actually very oh. nice. We're sitting just under 100 kilometers an hour, cruising along on this beautiful, smooth Rajasthani flat road. After doing barely, what, 20 k's per hour? Pretty much. <laughs> this is, yeah. oh my goodness, it's lovely. All right, 122 k's, we're on, back on the toll road. Going in the right direction. So, we, just went past a spot that we had a magical time with on one of the first rides we did with Good Vibrations and uh, it was when there was a the Ganesha festival and we got pulled into the water with all the locals. Clothes, boots and all, Absolutely. off our bikes. It was so much fun. Riding bikes. And, uh, yeah. So I was right about that rough road. You were. I knew it. We'd been there before. Yeah, you And here we're know. coming through the section of this village, which is just so pretty with the trees that arch over the road. Trees and cows. That arch over the very smooth road. Yeah. <laughs> smooth road has felt really good. Nope. Buying fireworks time. Flower pots. King of <laughs> King bomb. Atom bomb. It's written on this one. Standard atom bomb. This one looks just dangerous. It's a spinner. <laughs> oh my god. Talk about it. Taken back to childhood. Tika. Han. Han. Uh, we take uh, punch. Punch? Five pieces. Uh, how many? Ek? One, two, three. Ten pieces. Okay. Okay. Tika, Tika. Hey, Jonna. Do they have sparklers? Yes, we've got sparklers, darling. Awesome. <laughs> so. Hey, hey. Um, web dough? Um, rocket, rocket. rocket, whistling rockets. It's a flying horse. Flying horse. It's two hundred twenty rupees written on it. That's like four dollars forty. Oh no, 2,250. Okay, inside here. Whoa, God, whoa, hey. <laughs> no, no. 10 rupees. 10 rupees. One piece. One piece is okay. Okay, we take. Take punch. Okay, now, bus. <coughs> Right, that's quite the fireworks purchase. I haven't done this for a very long time, but the little boy in me used to get so excited going to the fireworks stalls and looking through the glass boxes and knowing we were going to get to have so much fun with Tom Thumbs and Pohars and Jumping Jacks and Catherine Wheels. Don't quite know what I bought here, but we're going to find out tomorrow night. Did you get the Catherine Wheel? 
I don't know if they've got, I don't know what Catherine wheels would The ones be. that spin, Manu said. Yeah, okay, we try. You have a uh, spinner? Yes, yes. Spinner? Ah, oh, he's good at it. Spinner? Mera Patni is, no, 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 this. This is, oh, I, have, I have spinner, this one. Hans, Hans, okay. Yeah, it's okay. Okay, now it's okay. It's only a very short, short one. <laughs> We just had a moment there, didn't we, darling? Uh, yeah, we Turned did. into that road and went, bloody hell, where's Google taking us? <laughs> but we're good. We're back onto a smooth road. All right. Phew. There was an adventure through the village. It was. <laughs> well, we're in Jodhpur now. We made it. Jodhpur is known as the Blue City, so in the old part, or a majority of it, really. They paint all the buildings blue. Yeah, it looks magnificent from looking looks down from amazing. the port. It's very Greece blue. It's yeah. A similar colour to that in Greece. But um, it's also a very heavily military city as well. So we're, the areas we've been coming through mm. are, are actually really well kept. Very green, a lot of trees. Yeah. Um, but we are right on the edge of the desert now. So the we landscape's are. changed dramatically. No more hills. It's very flat. Um, and Jodhpur is, you know, it's a, a major city. It has an amazing fort, which is well worth a visit. This is our third or fourth time here. Um, the place we normally stay at, Devi Bhagwan, is not available, but we've got a new place to go to, yeah. that so, palace. So we're going to get to see what it's nice. like. We're one minute away. One minute away, which is cool. <laughs> All right, we're making it work against the traffic. Against the traffic, because okay. we went in the wrong gate. And then we looked at a hotel that made us cringe. And think that can Ah, uh, this be is it. better. This is more like it. Namaste, <laughs> G. Uh, oh yeah, we have booking under Jonathan, Jonathan Spark. Your mobile number? Uh, 955. Five. Oh, this is lovely. Thank you. Thank you, Manu. You've done a good job again. Namaste. Oh, oh wonderful. Fantastic. I don't think we're going to go anywhere. I think we're just going to stay here. We're just here. going to stay here. It's been a long day. <laughs> and dinner timing is 7 to 10.30. Okay. Uh, what? Both are sitting available inside and outside. Oh, mm -hmm. very nice. So we've been upgraded. Yes. So, so this is... So lovely. <laughs> <laughs> You're okay after that rough ride? Yeah. This is all right? Yeah, it <laughs> is. a place to relax. <laughs> Oh, and it has a, a sitting area. Mm. I've said it before in other videos, but one of the great blessings of our life here in India and the fact that we've got the most amazing business partner and dearest friend in Manu is that he manages to make these things possible for us. Yeah. It's quite the gift, isn't it? It is. This is very nice. Namaste, Dostal. Well, good morning, friends. We're on day two of our road trip to Falodi. We've left Jodhpur after staying in a, a beautiful uh, part of an old palace that's been converted to a hotel. I'm still shifting ahead cold. Yasmin is doing well. We have a new friend. <laughs> Hello, He's the prettiest and loveliest Hello. boy. And we have an old friend join us. <laughs> She's back. <laughs> <laughs> Safely. <laughs> And we've just stopped here to <coughs> on a roadside. I wouldn't quite call it a dubber because really it's just got some toilets and some chapoys and a little cafe kitchen, but we just stopped to have a chai. So it is Diwali today. So we're um, looking forward to Diwali? catching up with our yeah, family um, and friends. Today and tomorrow. Today and tomorrow. We have entered into the real heartland of Rajasthan which is, uh, the topography has really changed now, hasn't it? It is, it's more desert-like, um, with acacia trees, greening things. Camels, camels sort of catching shade under them. Yeah, eating, uh, eating the leaves on the acacia trees. Get these little clusters of men gathering under the shade as well. So shade becomes a really big thing out here. It is 35 degrees and it's not summer. It's not summer, no, but, it's, um, it's moving towards winter. It is moving towards winter. I don't know if the desert region knows that. No, maybe not. By 2 p.m. today, it could be 36, 36 degrees. 
So we are about 25 k's out of Filodi, which is the larger town near the village of our brother and friend's family, Manu, where he grew up. These roads are very, very smooth. They're very good roads. And it's actually a very clean area of India as well. So. It is. Actually, 35 degrees with only 25% humidity is rather nice. It's not too bad. I don't mind it. Monsoon with 89% humidity, even at 30 degrees, is pretty It's pretty, pretty hot. intense. Yeah. <laughs> Although I have noticed the air conditioner on the truck's working quite hard. It is. <laughs> it's a relatively smooth road today. And Jean is tucked in the back of the tar. Very comfortably. <laughs> We have arrived at Filodi, it's a desert city, town, that uh, is where Manu did his time growing up in the village nearby, so we're just going to meet him at the railway station. And, uh, yeah, we've been here a few times now, haven't we? We don't? have, it's generally a, on motorbikes. Generally on motorbikes, that's yeah. true, and um, stay at a lovely heritage hotel. And it's a, a cool desert town. Oh, that's a nasty stop. Oh, it is. Oh. Take that gently. Slowly yeah. on that one. <laughs> so good to see you. Happy Diwali. Happy nice kuta. <laughs> uh, where's my brother? Hey. Look, how many of them? They want to have a look at it. <laughs> look at this. All I become know. so curious. Hey, they don't because they? it's a non-touristic town. Yeah, right. That's hey, Turkish. Happy Diwali. <laughs> Namaste, G. Namaste. Ram Ram. Ram Ram. Ram, Ram. Hello. Ah, uh, look, they're already in the car. Oh, no, that's Turkish all covered. Oh, my God. Of course, you have to wear your veil. <laughs> Selfie. Hello, my dear. Happy Diwali. Happy Diwali. Happy Diwali. I'm, I'm ah. Little monkey, uh, get some. You're okay. Like oh, that. you're looking beautiful you again. Yeah, yeah. Soda is. Ah, who's this annoying uh, Indian leaning in on my wife? Juice. Come on, what are you doing? Leave her alone. <laughs> <laughs> Since it's a non-touristic town, so you become a center of attraction. Yeah, as you can see. Of course, they it's want not selfie like Jaipur, and I'm like, that hey. they see every day. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, yeah. That's the reason. Okay. Uh, she wants selfie. Oh yeah, you can. It's okay. Hey, you give me. I'm not giving out. No, no, stay there. No, no, you stay there. I'll take it from here. Okay, give me a phone and I take a selfie. Oh, just stuck in the market of uh, Belodi. <laughs> take that, darling. And uh, being probably the only Westerners in Filodi right now. Yeah, we've, we've been an, a bit of a novelty already. We have, and it uh, reminds me that <laughs> of how used to, how, how we've become used to in, is that the right wording? How in Udapur, <laughs> we just don't notice it so much we anymore. We don't now, no. But coming and, to Filodi, no. we're really standing out. Yeah. But it's a cool little village, which is about a town that's about 300 kilometers from all the big cities in there, Bikaner, Jalsamir, Jaipur, and, uh, we always really enjoy it. Yeah. And beautiful, bustling little towns. They're full of life and colour. It's really nice. Well. T A Y. <laughs> I can't get The cows around. have stopped us Go from round. making all the way to Manu's place. Go round. Yeah. But yeah, we are in his little village. That's his family yes. home just there. Yes. And that is our grandfather's. Um, little area. It is. Should we go around? I think we'll go further. We'll just see. It is, <laughs> a, it is a mini home. A mini home. Right. How will I get out of here? You're going to be stuck in there forever, Dhruv. That's Why? it. This is where you're staying for all of the valley. <laughs> Why? Where is the villa? It is around... Well, there's truckers in there. Where's the... Yeah, there it is. Gonna get the gate. How? Uh, Manu has a key. And we so have some guests who are lucky enough to come off the 
off the beaten tourist path, get to, to come and stay here. House, villa. Yes, it is, is it? Villa in do well. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Well. yeah. So we have a tube well there, uh, underground water, yeah. and then do the plantation. And the moment you are sitting in the villa, you just be on a jungle, <coughs> uh, like the Phew. plantations mm. and the. But you're saying that they, you get one good monsoon rain a year here, yeah. and that's enough for the millet, the sesame, the millet, seed. sesame seeds, yeah. mung dal, mm. but it's sometimes it's barley. There's Amazing. such an atmosphere, apart from the loud explosions, there's such an atmosphere because <laughs> like as far as the eye can see, it's just flat ground yeah. all around yeah. and you feel kind of, it must be amazing here at night with the stars. Absolutely. Incredible. Yeah, so we have uh, done starry nights on the roof. Yeah. It's quite high, so people can, you know, sleep under the stars. Last time we were here at night. Yeah, we were. Yeah, but, but I can't we remember here. the sky. Yeah. Yeah, we sent mm. here, but there was... That time there was no electricity or That's nothing. right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> yeah. the thing. Yeah. Quite the view. Yeah. Oh, Such a village you. experience. True, true, true Rajasthani. <laughs> village experience. Yeah. The What's temple that? over here. And now let us... And then, to keep in mind, it's my brother who designed this, created this, yeah. made this happen. And it's quite oh, wow. the space. <laughs> oh, bro. You have done so well. Oh, this is nice. Wow. Did we come up and look last time? No, year? only downstairs, not downstairs. upstairs. Downstairs. Ah. This is a big space. This is this is big. This oh, is like palatial. This. this is outside and the bathroom oh, the cubicles. Amazing. You won't get cubicle even four star hotels. <laughs> <laughs> it's big, wow. Mummy. It's big. So, so if you want a village experience, wow. this is the villa you get to stay in. Yeah. Where's Jim's bed? Very comfy. <laughs> the bathroom. bathroom. <laughs> Just down there. Actually, no, no. We'll just put a mattress and put a mattress on that. That'll fit you, Gina. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But good space. That's good amazing. Room. You know it's a great it's space. Great. It's a great room. It's a really you've done well. Yeah, I'm going you've to. Done. So this is Manu's father. Doing something he's probably done thousands of times. Yeah. Tying his own personal turban. I'm yet to learn this art. You haven't, and he's uh, always scolding me. He, well, you Why you haven't be, learned it? You I said yes. To be I'll, for that. I'll definitely learn. How many? How, how long is it? Look the at turban? Andy. Get the hand meter. Get the no. No meter. Nine. Nine. Nine meters. Yeah. And that's a standard turban length. Yeah. Is nine meters of material. Yeah. And the different colors. Different colors. Yeah. You see, turban um, very special, uh, you know, and very practical. And according to the style of the turban, you can guess which community they come from or which area they come from. And on special occasions, they used to have different turbans, like on Diwali, Holi. If somebody has died, then mm. different turbans. Okay. You know, it's not like you know, it's one style yeah. all the time. Yeah. Yeah. So there's a real um, story yeah. behind every turban. Yeah. So here, when um, someone has died, then, you know, as a symbol of mourning, people wear the white turban. Okay, white turban. So when you see a white turban, a man wearing yeah. white turban, it means that yeah. he's mourning. In the Under mourning period. Is it tr still traditional to shave the head as well? Yes. So in this yeah. culture, they shave That's the head That's on also. the 12th day of the deceased culture. Okay. okay. And the red... I have a large head. Mm. It'll fit in. You have to, uh, you know, squeeze it a little bit and fit in. Yeah, you can adjust. Oh. It will be good. Yeah, I just won't be dancing. Yeah. Handsome man. <laughs> Thank you, G. Yeah, all the diya like lamps we will lit. Yeah. Every light needs to be switched on, eh? Yeah. Nice turban, Nice turban, you like, darling? Yeah. Can we have a photo together? Yeah, sure. Manuji, would you do this? Yeah. Please? Thank you. Uh, special is this? The Diwali Puja in Manu's house with his family. His sister in laws and nieces, and brother, two of his brothers, joint family. Yeah. Yeah. It's so special. Always joint family. I don't know who these two pale-faced strangers are here, sitting in front of me, taking my view. 
no separation. <laughs> I'm learning that, bro. <laughs> yeah. Everything we united togetherness. Yeah, there's no such thing as personal space in no, India. No, no personal space. Ah. Sacrifices. And he has been taking a seat just there <laughs> with our guest Sergio. Huh? What do you say in Hindi? Paneer! Paneer! <laughs> and we have a professional photographer with us in Sergio, who's one of our Good Vibrations guests, capturing this moment so beautifully. Professional. Mm. I just don't want quantity. Yeah. To bring the light in. So we're having our, our kana, our food now. But mm. oh. I had to explain to everyone, of course, yeah, that okay. Okay. guests eat first. Yes. So all our Indian family are all sitting quietly watching us eat <coughs> as we enjoy all this wonderful homemade food. When I say all our Indian family are waiting, well, not even Mataji. waiting. Mataji. <laughs> Happy to have you. Om Jai Ma Lakshmi Mata. <laughs> and he does the honors, Jono. He's doing the honors. Make us proud. Oh, Jerry, I don't know. I haven't seen them, darling. <laughs> oh, oh was it's coming down. No, that was a whistle. It was just a whistler. <laughs> no whistle. It is. Oh, It was a little bit too far in. <laughs> Brilliant, Andy. Brilliant. Give them a pot. <laughs> we'll need some of our water bottles. Oh, okay. yeah. Rocket to do and failed. Let me, let me take off. Rocket failed at last. This one. Yeah, yeah, that one's scary, man. That one is scary. <laughs> Between, between Manu, myself, and Manu's brother, there's about 20,000 rupees. About 20,000 rupees, about $400, isn't it? That we spent. Yeah, all years. Yeah. And we're not even halfway through yet. People sometimes they spend 50,000. Crazy. Yeah, 50,000. Wow. Like, well, the man. That's, a, that's a, like a thousand New Zealand dollars. And, but you get a lot. You get a lot here. Except Jinmin. That's Once great. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And you're not supposed to keep it here. That was okay. me. That was me, Manu. That was, that was me putting the candle beside it. <laughs> that is the way you use the word bomb. Yeah, exactly, Manu. What do you call it? A Lakshmi bomb. Yeah, light it and throw, brother. Light it and throw. Quick! You'll be on the broom in the morning, Jintu. I'm sweeping up the courtyard. Oh! oh. <laughs> Did it get you? Blew the Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> 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 
If you want to. All right, Bo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's a bit dark here, but what you can't see is that this is a string of about a thousand uh, huge crackers. <laughs> All right, candle, light matches. You know, I'll run that side. Okay. <laughs> Enjoy today. <laughs> Brother, I can say, how old are we right now? No, there is a, there is a, there is a kid inside us that pops up every now and then. No, no. <laughs> Whoa, green. Woohoo! Nice. <laughs> Success! Wow! <laughs> 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 Knew what doing. Yeah. <laughs> 25 sounds, brother. Ha, 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 ha.